Hi, this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, and we have Eddie back here with us today for his second appointment. And as you remember, his first one was the severe low back pain, sacroiliac pain, and sciatica going down his leg. So we're doing a follow-up video with you today. He's still having some lower back pain and SI joint pain that's going down his left leg. So that's lumbal sacral radiculopathy. So let's check you out here, Eddie. Let's have you close your eyes and bend your head forward and backwards for me. Neutral. Back to normal. There you go. Hold that for just a moment. And he's got some forward head posture carriage, so that's putting a lot of additional weight-bearing compressive stress on his spine. And as you can see, he's also, his thoracic spine, lumbar spine are tilted off to the left of center as well. That's a negative Z thoracic and lumbar. His pelvis has shifted a little bit to the right of center. And he's rotated in his head a little bit to the left as well. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is decompress him with the ring dinger. So let's go ahead and lay you here, Eddie. Yeah, I thought I was beating you up on that first visit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> felt better though, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, it felt better. There we go. going to be our ring dinger of the day on our new channel. By the way, we got like 1,287 uh, new subscribers on our new channel. So we want to thank you for continuing to share that with your family and friends and co-workers. And try to get as many people as you can to subscribe to it. It's Advanced Chiropractic Relief LLC. And I think we've got six or seven videos on there now. And... Oh yeah. You feel that all the way down, Eddie? Yeah. Good. Okay. And he is still kicking even more. Yep. Yep. Keep breathing. Let me have your neck. Mm-hmm. Drop it in my hand. Perfect. Boy, that was perfect. Yes, sir. Good man. See what happens when you just let go and breathe? That was a good one. He'll feel a lot better when he quits hurting. <laughs> I was waiting. <laughs> <laughs> I say that jokingly, but at the same time, that's the truth. It really is. And that's usually fairly quickly in these type cases. I mean, he's already standing up better after that. We had a lady in here this afternoon. She'd been to see two other chiropractors, an orthopedist and a physiatrist, and came in here specifically to get the ring dinger today, and she walked out of here feeling better for the first time, and they recommended she have surgery. So the best way to avoid surgery is to decompress the disc, sucking the disc material back inside with a negative vacuum. That's what the spinal decompression on the y-axis does. And then adjusting the pelvis, which are made up of SI joints on each side, and then the lumbosacral joint right at the base of L5, and then the sacrum, which is the middle triangular shaped bone in the pelvis. There. And then L5 straight down. L4 straight P to A. Keep breathing for me, Eddie. There you go. That's it. The worst part's over. And I'm not going to kid you, these adjustments, when you're in as much pain as Eddie was when he first came in, uh, they're sore just because the bones themselves are so far out and you're inflamed so you know we recommended he put crushed ice on there at home i'm working on his paraspinal musculature deep tissue joseph's doing the same showing him some stretches and exercises to do at home so this is a partnership in health 
between the patient and the doctor and the staff and we're all working together to get him the optimal results so that he doesn't have to go get his back sliced on which in a lot of cases makes it even worse we had a patient fly here from New York one time he would had a minimally invasive back surgery quote unquote he went in there with the pain level of a 4 and they told him he'd be out walking around that afternoon he was in the hospital for 10 days and his pain level went to a constant 910 and he had permanent nerve damage all the way down his left leg into his feet with numbness that would not go away and was permanent on nerve conduction velocity and EMGs. That was a little better, wasn't it? Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do some deep tissue work on you though. Yeah, so take some deep breaths for me. He's not tilting as much right now. Mm -hmm. Did it feel easier for you to stand up that time? Yeah. Good. Okay, let's face the mirror again. And we're going to have you flex your head forward and backwards for me again, Eddie. And then normal. Yep, yeah. okay. So we're going to pull these guys up and back. 
You want to have your head up and then a little bit to the right here. Adjust your atlas right there in a mirror image. There. Okay, now do that same thing again, see if this feels any smoother to you. Back to normal. Yep, that looks better. Very good. How's that feel right now compared to when you walked in, Eddie? Oh, good. Better? Yeah, much better. Yeah, you generate a little heat when I'm adjusting, yeah. don't you? <laughs> That's good. This is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief, LLC in Houston, Texas. We'll see you next time.